Hey guys, it's Di and today we're going to be doing a toy surprise opening and we have these play foam pals that we're going to be checking out and you guys can see that these come in little individual packages so thank you to Educational Insights for sending a ton of these for us to open up. So I've got a yellow play foam pals here and I'm just going to take the wrapping off here and we're going to see what this is like on the inside. I like that it comes with a reusable container as well. And so we're just gonna test this opening out and see how this opens. This is our first one that I've opened. So you can see that that just comes off. It's just a big sticker on the outside. And then I like that it has this container that it's in that's reusable. So I'll get all the stickers off of this a little bit later. But I should just be able to pop that off. And then you can see down inside, you've got really nice play foam down in there. So it's really squishy and you can squish it down. And then hidden inside, one side, is one of our little play foam pets. You can see it is peeking out. Oh, it's so cute. And this looks like it is a little sloth. So we got a sloth as our very first play foam pal. And then you can tuck them back inside here. You can build little habitats for them. It's really super cute. So I really love this idea because my kids are really into these blind bags. And then they're also really super into play foam and building with it. So this is like the perfect combination for us. So this is our first little play foam pal, Mr. Sloth over there. And then we've got our play foam we can play with too. We'll do that in just a second. Let's open up this blue one and see what's in downside this one. I'm just gonna take this off and see what's inside. So I thought that these would be great little gifts. They're great to go down inside a basket. They'd be great little stocking stuffers. And they're just fun little like extra gifts like into the school year or special rewards. So my kids love the texture. If you've never had play foam, it's really, really neat because it doesn't dry out if you keep it like in a Ziploc and that sort of thing. And it doesn't make a huge mess. So I could stick it like here on this like I'm sitting on a chair, like pillow, and it's not gonna be a huge mess. It doesn't get on everything. So as a parent, I really appreciate how easy it is to use too. So we can make a little wave here, and let's see which animal we got down inside our blue play foam. So we're gonna open this up. Oh, and it's a little bear. That's very cute. The kids are gonna love these. How super cute is that? So we're gonna stick our little bear down inside this one and let's open up a couple more. And then we're gonna do a couple unboxings and openings with the kids after the next holiday. But for right now, let's see, let's do orange next. So let's see what's down inside the orange one. So you can see some of the different animals down here. There's an elephant, a lion, giraffe, a tiger, raccoon, bunny, panda. So there's all kinds of animals that we haven't even seen yet. So let's see what's down inside this one. So, I'm gonna find my edge and then the sticker just comes right off like this. See what's down inside. We're just gonna pop. There's our squishy play foam. This one's really hidden down inside. You see that one's really down in the top there. Oh, I bet this is a tall one. Let's see if we can figure out what's in this one. Am I guessing giraffe, maybe? I see ears. Oh, it was perfect. It was giraffe in the orange one. Look at how cute this little guy is. <laughs> this one's really cute. It's got this little tail on the back. So there is the giraffe. So I'm gonna stick the giraffe down inside the orange. That's what this one looks like. And there's our little giraffe down inside the play foam. You guys can see the little tail. This is what he looks like from the side. So we're just gonna stick him down in there. That's really cute. Then the next one that we're gonna open up is the pink one. These are so cute. We're gonna do, this was kind of like my, my test run to see how they opened up. And so now I know how they open up. I can do it with the kids and help them get them open. It's really super easy. The ages are five and up, so I definitely think a five-year-old could open these. So now you can see how they open. I just twist that apart. There's our pink play foam down inside. I'm gonna scoop in here and see where this little pet is. 
And the pink is kind of sparkly. It's kind of got some glitter down in there. These are super fun to build with. We've built a couple different scenes out of these. They're great for sensory bins. We've used them for all kinds of things. So I see some yellow poking through our bag here. And we got, oh, we got the little penguin. How adorable. This one is the little penguin. And it's perfect because it's pink. It matches the little penguin. So I'm gonna stick the little penguin down inside there. And there's a little pink penguin. Let's do one more. Let's do purple. Here's a purple. Let's see what's inside our purple one. We're starting to get a full house here. We're gonna have our own little play foam zoo. We could build our own little zoo and have like different areas. You can go visit. We've got our penguin, we've got our bear, we've got our sloth, we've got our giraffe. Let's see what's in our purple one here. So I'm gonna just open this up and take this off. There we go. Get this paper over to the side and we can zoom, open it right up. There's the purple. You can see it's a little bit, a little bit kind of squishy, but it sticks together really nicely and then you can mix the colors all together too. It's really fun and it has a lot of different possibilities. We love sensory play at our house. So down inside the purple, I see a little poke of blue. Let's see who this one is. It's a dinosaur! That's so cute. No, an alligator. It's an alligator. Look at this little guy. He's got a little tail and little chompers all the way around. I love that we got so many different animals. That's awesome. We've got our own little zoo going here. These are really cute and I love how versatile they are. So we've got the container that you can keep your play foam in. You can scoop all this play foam out and you could build your own little zoo. You can make all kinds of things with this play foam. So here on this paper, and you probably wanna keep the paper so that way it can seal up the holes on the bottom so your play foam doesn't uh, dry out. But you can collect all 12, and it has their names here. So this is Orlando, Orlando the alligator. This is Speedy the sloth. This is Pearl the bear. This is Chili the Penguin, and then this is Stretch the Giraffe. So there's still a number of them we haven't opened yet, so to be continued. The tiger's name is Kitty, that's adorable. The panda's name is Lucky. The penguin's name is Webster, that's really cute. And then it's got some fun different facts here. Did you know a lion's roar is so loud it can be heard up to five miles away? And pandas eat so much bamboo that they can go poop up to 40 times a day, interesting fact. Friendly elephants are social creatures and love to make new pals. So there is the little insert inside, series one, and then you can see like if it gets on the chair, no worries, it comes right off, it doesn't leave residue behind. And then you can squish these into anything. You can make like a little arch. If you wanna make like an arch, look at that. And then it stays. You can make like a cute little crocodile habitat, alligator habitat. I can never know the difference between those two. There you go. And you can make a wave, you can make a boat, you can make a log, you can do all kinds of things. So I love how this uses their imagination and it's really kind of two toys in one because they can make something for their little animal that they get and it's kind of like a little mini animal habitat too. So these are all of our little play foam pals. So thanks to Educational Insights for sending these to us to check them out. We absolutely love play foam in our house. We love sensory play. So these are right up our alley. We also love animals. So these are really cute little gift to give and they'd be great for birthdays as well. Or just as even as a travel gift because the great thing about play foam is that, I mean, I would let my kids have this in the car because you can get this you know, on anything, on their clothing, and it's not gonna stain, it's not gonna leave a residue. So it's even a cute little tra car or travel item as well. So these are our first couple Play Foam Pals. We'll have some other videos coming up with these in the future as well. And thanks so much for watching. Have a great day.